When we issued the report last year, I was uh, invited to a meeting with the Commission, uh, which is not something that happens every day. Normally they would ignore us. And, and there was little me with uh, two heads of departments and one legal expert and two more people. They were very concerned with the, with the report. And in the course of that meeting, it became very obvious that they are super nervous about the political initiatives that go across borders between cities. So, yeah. Thank you. So, thank you very much for the question also because I uh, would... W uh, wouldn't want to come like the the one doing advertising for Airbnb, which is not <laughs> didn't pay me. So <laughs> and no, but it, well, I think I think um, um, there are two. We we can summarize this uh, say either saying they might be um, become to be not effective at all, um, in the sense that it's super di too difficult to compete in a market which is already almost monopolized by Airbnb, and so they they might risk to just run into nothing and just don't get any kind of scale, scaling up and never not even getting a chance to to implement something or maybe if they do it very well they might resemble more and more Airbnb I think there are maybe these two poles uh, while I think that the first one might be more realistic just because uh, we know how market monopolies work um, I think uh, one other thing pr risky thing that I see is that one when you say and the, the money that I raise, I'm going to give it to lo local projects. As a sociologist, I know that there are uh, the, this idea of participatory processes and so on are always very much fil filtered. Um, like those people can participate who have the resources to participate, first of all. So uh, you, you, it's very difficult to get um, to, to start a, a participatory process which really comes from below because it's always a, a question of, of struggle for, uh, from my perspective and, and which comes from below as you, as you all showed with, with, with the protests and also what you said that um, uh, that's the direction which is effective so to speak from, from down to up. Um, so yeah, the, this is what I would say. Um, then there is a, the fact of the cooperatives. Uh, I mean in Italy there is a long tradition of cooperatives especially in central Italy and we have seen how they have also for instance acquired a lot of power and have also used it not in such a democratic way. So it, it, I also think we shouldn't um, tend to think that cooperatives, just the, the magic word cooperative, um, uh, then makes every problem vanish. Um, I think it doesn't work like that. But at the same time, I also think, and this is the positive part, um, that um, as digitalization is there and, and platform capitalism is there, we also cannot say, okay, we, we do like pretend like it's not there. And so, I mean, I think it's there are attempts and we are starting to, so I think it's, an, it's my, my perspective will be that it's an interesting step anyway, going somewhere at least. So, that's So, thank you all for coming. I hope you appreciate it. Thank you very much the invited speakers and see you. <laughs>